Chinese dragon begins, with the front side facing up. Fold the page in half, edge to edge. This will create a vertical crease down the center. Turn the paper over and unfold. Now, fold the bottom edges to that center line. Repeat on the other side. Turn the paper over and unfold. Now with the front side facing up, fold the creases you just made to the center line. Crease along the outside edge and repeat on the other side. form the nose, we do a series of three folds. First, we fold up at the narrowest point. Now, we find the widest point and we fold the other layer along that line. make the third crease by folding at the widest point. Once re those are creased, unfold the nose and reorder the creases by folding up at the first back down at the second, and up again at the widest point. Flatten the nose firmly. Now, open up the pockets on the side and squish fold to form the nostril. You can fold the flap as far as it will as far as it'll go. And then open it up and squish fold it along the center. Valley fold the entire head in half. Fold down so that the top edges of the wings fall along the bottom edge of the fuselage. Flatten, turn over, fold down the other wing to match, now we're going to add a lock to the back the fuselage. Fold the back edge up to the crease where the wing begins. Unfold it halfway and squish fold along the center line.
now we'll fold the top edges to the, to the center line. This forms a diamond. Unfold and pull the pocket down to form a short pointy flap. Now fold it back up, and this forms a frog base, although some people will call it a petal fold. Now fold that part in half, and curl the back out edges out a little bit at the base of the wings. The lock is completed. dragon's head is ready to fly.